Yo, what is good, everybody? My name is Toto, and I'm a KO main. Some of you may know me as the Pocket KO from TikTok. If you don't, hi, welcome. I like playing more of a support KO role for my team. Welcome to my first full KO flash guide on Ascent. This is KO's strongest map by far. Let's get it started. Before we start the lineup guide, there are a few different basic things that you should know about KO's flash and the distance that it pops. For KO's left click throw, the distance to pop the flash is about 25 meters. So if you ping on the map, let's see 25 here, 25 meters. Aim a little bit high, throw the flash. It will pop about 25 meters. If you do a running throw, it's going to pop about 35. And if you walk backwards, it will pop about 15 meters. I'm walking backwards. And I throw it. It pops about 15 meters. A lot of the times, throwing a flash high in the sky and behind your teammates around 25 meters, 35 for a run is pretty much all you really need to do. With that said, let's get started with the gun. This flash is used to take aim and control. Most of the time, I prefer using a silver dart or some other piece of util to clear this angle. I like using my flashes to fight sight more. But if you have to and you don't have any other pieces of util and your team has trouble fighting for this space, then I'd use this flash. Just line up at the edge of this wall here. Aim at the corner of this roof right here and just do a normal throw. Flash, flash pops right here, blinding anyone that's peeking this angle. If there's an op here, they'll get blinded. If someone's walked up, they will also get blinded. If your team wants to attack A, there are a few different flashes that I like to do. The most common and basic one that I say is pretty effective most of the time is just simply just throwing a flash over this wall. Flashbang. Pops high in the sky and it will blind anyone that's peeking sight, allowing for your duelist to entry. If you want more of like a set flash, what you can do is stand in this corner right here, there. aim at the bottom of this right here, and do a jump throw. That flash pops here and does the same thing as the flash over the A main wall. Except this flash binds people that are tucked close here. Other than that, a simple flash over this wall will do the job. Once your team has taken A's that control and you guys have planted the bomb, I like to use this post plant flash to fight for A heaven. So to do this flash, go in this corner and aim at this bar right here. Anywhere along this bar will work. It will blind heaven and it won't blind any of your teammates looking heaven this flash is really flexible because you could do this anywhere on this against this wall i just sit here because this is usually the safest spot a lot of the times i will tell my teammate to crouch on this box right here and jump up and peek off of this flash i don't really use this one too much but if you ever want to do a self flash for heaven crouch on the stairs here just aim at the corner of this little shadow right here while well, crouch and you throw this and you jump up and it won't blind you and it will blind anyone in heaven for the next flash it's a little aggressive it can be kind of risky but it's fun to do when you have the right timing when you have a heaven smoked off and you have a teammate that's aggressive enough to be in that smoke line up anywhere along this wall right here pretty much as long as you could see this right here i aim in the middle between these two wires and just do a jump throw the flash will pop right here, blinding anyone here, allowing for your character that's sitting in your A Heaven smoke to peek out of this smoke and kill these guys. Be careful though, if people are tucked here, it won't blind them, so it's a bit risky. If you are ever stuck on sight, there are a few different flashes that you could use to help yourself out, and your team can also peek off of it. If you are ever stuck behind generator, you see these two wires, aim to the left of it, and just do a normal throw. Flashbang. Flash will pop right here, allowing you to swing either side without getting blinded. You can do the same type of flash off of this wall right here. Flashbang. And your teammates won't get blinded as well, heaven. If you are hell, you could pretty much do the same thing. I like to there. slightly tap W and throw a flash off of this generator here, flash. like that. It will pop behind dice as you're rotating. I like to just check a flash over this bar right here. Any, any flash over this bar is going to pop high in the sky like this. It's going to be behind your teammates so it won't blind them. And it will blind anyone coming out to sight. And it's really hard to react to. If you're ever tree and you guys need help on sight, a simple jump throw flash over this wall. It's going to pop high in the sky blinding anyone on site to retake a site there are a few different flashes that i like to use i like to line up with a third pull right here aim at the top of this pull aim slightly above it aim between the pole and the brick wall so like right here and just do a normal throw that flash pops through the tarp blinding every single spot except here and hell for the second retake flash i like to line up at the edge of this window there's a little dark spot right here there's aim anywhere above that dark spot so just like there, do a normal throw. 
If you walk out with this flash, it blinds pretty much everything, including hell. All right, moving on to aggressive support A flashes. One that I like to do is have a teammate play a main like this. I like to stand in this corner and I aim at the bottom of this little ledge line right here. I chuck this flash and I will blind A main and it will be behind my teammates so they only get partially blinded. And they could swing off of that flash. If you want to fight A main super aggressively, what you can do is ha tell your jet to dash up right here. And what you can do is stand in this corner, aim at this brick on the wall in the middle, and do a jump throw. Flash, flash pops right here. It will blind anyone A main. Your jet can dash up, catch the enemies off guard. I like to combine this with an omen blind. It could definitely get you some free kills. Moving on to cat, there are a few different flashes that I like to do. One would be to stand in the middle of these two sewers, aim in the middle of these two branches here, do a normal throw. Flash will pop high in the sky right here, blinding anyone top mid, Sabrosa walking up cat. A lot of the times when the enemy team is hard pushing A and we stall them and they start to rotate, they will rotate through mid. And this is the perfect time for your teammate to fight this aggressively. You can catch him off guard with this flash. If your teammate ever wants to peek cat, what you can do is stand in this corner right here, aim anywhere in this space, and do a normal throw. Flash will pop here, blinding anyone tiles. There are two flashes that I like to use to fight cat. The first one is to stand in this corner right here. See this line on the wall right here? Aim a little bit to the right of it, where the shadow is. Do a normal running throw. The flash will pop perfectly for your team to fight cat. The next flash is a bit harder, but it is pretty cool. See where this dot on the wall is. Go over the edge of that. You want to crouch. You see where these brown spots are. Aim in the middle between this and this line right here. And you want to do a jump throw while crouched. The flash will bank off of this. Pops in the sky right here, and it will blind anyone holding this angle right here. Anyone who will here will be blinded, and also anyone here will also be blinded. Moving on to mid, there are a lot of flashes that you could do to help your mid guys out. Say they are bottom mid, or they are cat, and they want to peek middle. Any flash through this little roof can help your teammates out. It will blind high in the sky, and it will blind anyone mid, basically. I normally stand in this corner, and I aim it slightly above this tarp right here. Just do a normal throw. Flash. This flash pops here. They really can't even see it coming. It allows for your guys bottom mid or cat, anyone to swing off of. Say you have a guy cat or a guy bottom mid and there are heavily fighting mid. What you can do is just run and jump throw a flash over this like this. A flash pops high in the sky, blinding anyone pretty much out in the open. It's a good support flash if you're rotating and they need help, it does the job. If your team ever wants to fight tiles aggressively, what you can do is stand in the middle of this door, aim at the patch of dirt right here, and just do a normal throw. This flash blinds tiles and allows your jet to dash up, your neon to run up, your raise the satchel up. Anyone that wants to fight this for attacking mid, I like to do this one flash that blinds mid and it doesn't blind your teammates. Tell your, your teammate to smoke off cat because you will be slightly exposed to cat. Line up with this wall right here. Move slightly forward until you can see the window. Once you see the window, you can aim at the top of the window and do a normal throw. You and your teammates can swing off of this flash. It won't blind you because it will be behind the arch. Since we are still mid, you're stuck pizza and they're rushing your guys on B. A flash that I like to do that helps your guys stairs or lane to fight anyone that's peeking sight as they're coming out. Aim at the top of this line right here and just do a jump throw. You do a jump throw, it, the flash pops right here, blinding anyone that's coming out. If you are market and you want to have the same effect kind of and you want to peek yourself, I see a lot of players just flash out of the smoke and just get like tapped usually. Another way you could do it is stand or anywhere on the market and just chuck a flash off of this wall here it blinds anyone switch so if jet's closing the door it'll blind him anyone coming out anyone lane looking market if you ever want to fight b main aggressively and have your teammate push up off of this flash a flash i like to do is standing in the middle of this door here i aim at the top of this roof right here and i move it slightly up until it's in line with this thing here so just like that and do a normal throw Flash will pop through this window right here, blinding anyone B main, anyone walked up here even. 
allowing for your guy to peek off of this flash and maybe even push through and get more kills another flash you could do is just kind of winging it as again the 25 meter mark you could just check a flash behind them like this it's gonna pop and be behind them and they could swing B main players like that to attack b site there are two flashes that i mostly use for the first one if you don't have an omen blind to blind this opera angle or you don't have another piece of utility to clear it what you can do is stand in this corner right here see this pull right here line it up until you hit the bottom of the frame right here and do a normal throw this flash will take the opera off this angle if even if they're holding a pixel angle they will be blinded stand in this corner aim to the left of this little ledge right here and just do a normal throw flash. this flash pops here it will blind anyone that's sitting here yeah. and anyone that's sitting here yeah. and anyone peeking here the one that i like to do the most i like to stand in this corner back here until you can see this window aim to the bottom of this lamp right here to the right of it and do a slight w throw flash. like that flash pops right here it will blind anyone on site anyone lane and also anyone holding this ledge right here i like to tell my jet to dash over the top onto site and i'll combine it with that flash if you're ever lane and you're trying to fight site you're leading the charge a lot of kales will do this say i'm flashing and they're they return and fight it teammates may or may not turn from that blind what you can do instead is just go to the edge of this wall right here see these bricks right here and just do a normal throw and you could flash it like that it'll pop behind here once your team has taken b site and you guys have planted the bomb there are a few different post flashes that i like to use for your team to retain site to play lane what you can do is line up with the edge of this wall right here see this island right here what you can do is aim at the top of this island like right here the top of that rock do a normal throw the flash will pop right here blinding anyone that's coming out spawn anyone coming out market it's gonna be behind your teammate that's lane your teammate can swing off of that another post plant flash that i like to do is i like to tell my teammate to hop on this ledge here and play here off of my flash i will go back boathouse and i'll put my back against the wall here i scoot until i see this pole right here and i aim at the top of the pole and i do a flash normal throw flash pops right here anyone that is lane or looking lane can't even see the flash your teammate ledge should be able to get some free kills off of that if your teammate is ever back boathouse and he's getting rushed by the enemy team and he's the only one on site there's this flash that you could do to help him out just aim anywhere around this pillar right here and just do a running jump throw the flash pops here in the sky blinding anyone coming out lane and it also blinds anyone coming stairs your guide back boat can swing off of this flash if you are ever rotating from A and your teammates are getting rushed on B like super fast, around the time where you get to this line here is where you want to throw it. You see these two windows in the sky right here? Just check a flash. Just like so. The flash pops here as they're coming out. It allows for your Sarah's guy to peek as they're coming out it can help them if you time it right so yeah that's pretty much all the flashes that i like to use on this map if you enjoyed the video leave a like or comment down below if you enjoyed the content and want to see more drop a sub i appreciate you guys all for watching comment what map i should do next i'll see you guys later